Hi Virgo, this is your weekly day by day tarot cards reading by Emma for the week beginning 6th of June 2022. Alright, we'll start immediately with Monday the 6th of June for you Virgo. The Hangman. Tuesday the Empress. Wednesday, Three of Swords. Thursday, Three of Cups. Friday, the Moon. Knight of Wands, Saturday. Seven of Cups, Sunday. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Three of Pentacles, your influencing energy. Okay, I'm going to comment on it just now. <coughs> Pardon me. The Hangman with Two of Cups Monday. The Empress Tuesday with Five of Wands. Three of Swords with the Hangman again. Three of Cups Thursday with the Devil. The Moon with Two of Wands. Knight of Wands Saturday with King of Cups. And Seven of Cups Sunday with the Tower. Strength and the Three of Pentacles. Look, the Three of Pentacles is lovely energy. We were talking about something um, practical you are doing. You are enjoying it. Maybe with this new group of people, newness stands with this very young energy, Three of Pentacles. You are doing something maybe first time or it's it's very new skill that you have. But it's like your hobby. You are liking it. You are loving it. You are enjoying it. That new things. It's Something is already on the ground. With Three of Pentacles, things are happening. You are doing things already and it's visible. And you are admired for that, what you have done, what you are doing. You are putting lots of effort effort it's very important for you to keep things under control to carry on learning studying carry on doing things improve it make it bigger better you see what i'm saying a lot of effort you are putting into something new okay very practical energies from last week look this hung man present on monday and wednesday now on monday with the two of cups Look, it seems to me that you are aware that you still have to, I don't know, learn something or do something or wait for something to develop, okay? With the hangman, you are hanging, okay, yourself upside down to wait for something. But you are doing it with purpose. Something is down the road, supposed to bring enlightenment. You were quite pleased with yourself, pleased with something you made already, okay? You came to the certain point all right you've done something earlier on you did put lots of effort you put things on the ground okay now at this point on monday you were pleased with yourself with everything that you have done but now you are not ready to move on there is extra knowledge extra experience something else you supposed to wait for okay wait for it know it understand it learn it okay Nothing that interrupts you or, or surprises you or annoys you. In fact, you are aware of it. You are liking it. You want it. You do, you do understand. If you want to master this skill, you have started to learn or to make this business successful, you have to have more knowledge. You have to have more experience. Something still you have to have. You are doing it with purpose, with satisfaction. You are satisfied with yourself. You are not annoyed at all. You are doing it with purpose you've got intention to learn to do something in the meantime you are expecting enlightenment end of the day look very pleased with yourself again the empress energy is being satisfied okay enjoying the moment that what you have till now you were enjoying okay you are having something done and that will produce something else further on greatest expectation what will follow what will happen what will be born and what will grow in your life later on very calm very pleasant very satisfying energy okay out there but you within yourself 
begin to question something. What from here? What now? What do I learn first? What do I do first? I kind of felt that you have to have some sort of experience. You have to have some sort of knowledge. And this is that sort of training. These people are practicing these fighting skills. You are practicing something. You are putting things together and still chaotic in here, still very beginning, still inexperienced, but carry on. You will get enlightenment you will be experienced it will happen later on you see what i'm saying in that sense you are struggling here to find actually your way forward how you're gonna straighten yourself up how you're gonna move on how you're gonna acquire your knowledge you see what I'm saying? You know that you have to have further knowledge. Now you are struggling here how to. So something is very successfully done till now. From this point now, you are struggling and you have a slight confusion how to. You might be having some sort of obstacles from outer sources, okay? You are expecting that things will happen already. You will have a knowledge. You will have advice. You will have guidance, but you don't have it, okay? On when that you will be very disappointed about that what's supposed to happen supposed to bring you enlightenment that's supposed to bring you knowledge now that isn't there that person or something whatever it is isn't there doesn't happen it's not here on wednesday look three of cups is you know you and your friends you and your buddies your uh, sisters um, best friends you know having some good times okay for whatever reason. In fact, you don't even have reason. With the devil's energy, you do not have reason. This is Thursday. And in fact, you might be very disappointed because that was supposed to arrive, that's knowledge, that's something you expected to have, something very meaningful, very important for you. Didn't come here on Wednesday. You might be calling your friends to drink with you because you are disappointed. You just bought some wines and you called your friends and you are complaining and you are complaining because you are stuck, you are chained, you are dependent on this person, you are dependent on this knowledge and you don't have it. You people are drinking to drown your sorrow and your disappointment in alcohol on Thursday. Could very well be something like that. You have moon here, could be very much hungover on Friday. This is not being certain, your judgment is clouded. You have uncertainty, you're not sure when this, I don't know, something very beautiful, very successful, when it's going to move forward, when you're going to get this knowledge, when you're going to get this enlightenment. You see what I'm saying? Something you are waiting for and it doesn't happen yet. You are very disappointed. You are standing in front of this, I don't know, portal. You're supposed to move on you've got greatest plans okay two of cups you being so happy with yourself greatest new beginning you have out there very successful new openings for you here for your career for your life something much better than that which you have but you are still standing in front of these doors you don't have green light to move through to go for it you don't have knowledge, green light, understanding, decision, go ahead. You do not have it yet, okay, on Friday. And you do not know when it will come. Look, this energy also doesn't last long. Moon energy is very quick, passes quickly. It's a daily one. And look, on Saturday, perhaps you might actually receive that very exciting news because Knight of Wands will change something, okay? This energy on Saturday comes to change this emotional state of yours. Look, much better feelings now. You are very satisfied with yourself, with King of Cups, being very calm, satisfied, very pleased with yourself, emotionally calm and satisfied. You see what I'm saying? Yet we did have these disappointments, this turbulence. Now, much better. Big change within you, in your your emotional state because something exciting came your way this could be person okay just takes you out let's have good times you know don't worry things will be all right it's saturday let us have a good times let's go party let's do something fun could be something like that okay unrelated to this career or business things just charming jolly person takes you out to have good times lovely saturday could be just like that could be also exciting information 
information, exciting news, which will mean moving forward, okay? Knight of Wands, very fast energy, movement forward, energy will take you forward, so you can create, so you can do your business, your career, whatever that you are busy, you can move on in that sense, Saturday as well. Look, Sunday with the Tower and Seven of Cups. Look, the Tower says change and change within you and a drastic change. Something you believed in, okay, you did have idea where you are going, um, why you are doing that, what you are doing, that business, that career, that something practical will mean for you something, so and so thing. You see what I'm saying? And then you do have delays and delays. And finally, you do have information which will change something here. Okay, change your approach, change your understanding, what you're supposed to expect from now on. Seven of Cups are your dreams, fantasies, expectations, options, opportunities. Now, you do have lots of options options. You do have lots of opportunities for yourself, but something you believed in, you expected, will fall away. But it will not leave you desperate. In fact, it will open up, okay, more opportunity, better opportunity. You see what I'm saying? I really believe this night of wands on Saturday, perhaps, brought some sort of change. That what you waited for, you expected to happen, okay? It's not going to happen. Something else will replace it, but it's better for you. It brings better options, better opportunities for you. You see what I'm saying? It's not that you were annoyed or desperate. You were actually very optimistic and excited about what could be from now on. Some sort of change of plans will surprise you. It will be positive change, but not before these disappointments, because you did have your plans. You worked over something. You expected something else. You see what I'm saying? But anyway, end of the day, everything works well for you. Its change is actually for the better. Without these unfortunate delays, you wouldn't have such great opportunities for yourself in, in that kind of sense. I think Taurus did have a very similar energies like you, Virgo. Anyway, enjoy it.